how to make sure your customers can find you. <laughs> when people go onto Google, we wanna make sure that you're coming up not just from organic traffic, not just from organic content that you're creating, but also make Google actually refer people to your business using Google listings. You need to make sure that you are on directories online in your area, in your town, in your region. Of course, if you're global, you just don't simply apply a particular area. Now, one way that you um, can get your business to come up in people's search results is to list your business in Google's business directory listings. So what you're gonna wanna do is go to Google My Business. Uh, when you're in Google My Business, click on that, there's one, google.com.au, I'm in the AU, obviously you will have it in your place. Um, press continue. Now if you have a Google account, great. If you don't, you might need to set one up. Um, but basically then, once you've created an account and logged in, this is where you'll basically be given a profile that's a bit like this. Now at the moment, I've actually just changed my whole business address because I've just moved house, so my profile's back under review again. So every time you make a significant change, like an address change, um, it will be reviewed by Google and you'll just have to wait about three to five days for Google to approve your listing. Um, so you will need to make sure that the address you list on Google is the address that matches your registered business address as well. So for me, this is why I've kind of gone to the um, extent of paying uh, for a proper suite at my post office box. Now, by the way, suite doesn't mean a physical building. Um, it's a, simply a PO box, uh, but they allow you to use the word suite so that it doesn't look like a PO box. So it's a really clever way. And I, I think this costs me about, I know, $120 a year or something like that. That way I have the security and the privacy, like my home address isn't being shared, which is really important. Um, you do you do get some crazy people in the online business world, so I don't want people knowing where I live, to be fair. So for me, like 120 bucks a year to use the word PO box or suite 54 in this uh, this example is, is really, really important for the safety and security of my family and for myself. Also, I think it just looks more professional. Um, so I've put in this, uh, this PO box address here that is my registered business address. Excuse me, somebody's cutting grass outside at the moment. Um, but the show will go on, we're gonna keep filming. But basically all you do is you put in your, your business name, you put in what type of business you're in, your address, what areas you service. Now, this is useful because Google will offer your business as a solution or a result to people that are Googling in those particular regions. So I would actually go through here and add sort of my top 10 countries, uh, the top 10 countries that uh, my customers are basically being referred from. Uh, so that I get uh, come up in those search results. You put in your working hours, um, and then you can basically go in here and update anything you want. You put in your website details, you can put in full deep descriptions, you can put in links, you can put in tags, keywords that people might be typing into Google, um, and then you'll press verify. And if this is the first time you've done this, it will take a bit longer because uh, to originally uh, verify your account, Google will send you a postcard and it has a verification key on that postcard. So you might have to wait a week or two for that postcard to come. You log back into Google My Business, you type in your verification code that Google sent you, um, and then that makes your account live, basically, and that's just so that there's no fake um, business profiles up on the internet. Um, so there you go. This is now a great way for you to be able to come up with people's search results. Your business shows up on Google. You get it verified, which gives even more trust and credibility. So make your next action task to go in and set up your Google My Business profile.